before we get into this video please subscribe to my channel click the bell notification button and please like this video as well hello everybody welcome back to my channel as you guys have seen by the title of today's video today i will be doing one of my most favorite videos to film and that is a makeup collection because my collection of makeup is always always increasing I seem to have nowhere to put my makeup these days but I thought that I would film an updated one because I'm sure you guys are eager of what makeup I do have in my collection honestly I have so much makeup it's unbelievable I was sorting through all my drawers before and I'm actually shocked and kind of disgusted as well at the amount of makeup that I have in my drawers because I was not expecting to see so much makeup like it's actually crazy but without further ado let's get on with the video so as you guys who can't see from this area, I do have like a dressing table. So this has all my lovely perfumes on, it has like hand sanitizers, jewellery, it has like all my makeup brushes. I do have some Alex 5 drawers in here which is where I actually store all my makeup and honestly I will have to get another set of Alex 5 drawers soon because I do not have any space to put in my makeup like all my makeup drawers are jam packed with makeup and skincare in them but yeah but here is my kind of makeup area um it's all from ikea ikea have the best kind of makeup desks and honestly the storage like for makeup and skincare and everything is unreal so yeah but anyway i'll kind of show you guys around this area because i would be interested if I were YouTubers because I love watching these videos on YouTube but yeah I will start off with my perfumes over in this corner on my dressing table I do have like all my perfumes all my body sprays so a few of my favourite perfumes which I love is the classic Lady Million I am aware of my dodgy tan on my like wrist area I do need to exfoliate it off because it is old tan but I do have the Lady Million perfume which is one of my favourites um, I also sell Libra perfume, which is my ultimate favourite perfume. Like, it's such a holiday scent. Actually, I did, actually did buy this in Lanzarote, but it's my favourite perfume. Um, Jimmy Choo perfume, Daisy Love, Ted Baker, Alien, Heavy Esprits, a Machino perfume. I love the packaging of this. Look how cool that is. It's like a, there's like a spray bottle. And then, I do have some Soap and Glory sprays as well. And I do have some fake flowers in the vase. Soap and Glory hand cream hand sanitizer to kill all them germs and like a makeup brush as well and then if you move down over here let's kind of zoom in for you all that's it i do have her skincare drawer i absolutely love this drawer because you know why the baby lips in here are so organized look at that look how organized it is in the drawer here i do have my everyday moisturizer it is a neutrogena one and like it's a Oil free work, I've got oily skin, like I have like face mask, pore strips, face masks, cleansers and everything in there. I do have a mirror on here as well, so hello everybody. But if we move down here, I do have like Homo jewellery, Vivian Westwood, Tiffany. I love the colour box, look at that box. A Louis Vuitton bracelet as well. I do have uh, like some other pairs of earrings and watch just round here and some eyelash boxes as well because as you know me I love my eyelashes and then if we move over here I'm so clean for cleaning my makeup brushes this is the best cleanser ever for cleaning for cleaning your makeup brushes for cleaning your makeup brushes so affordable I do have like a little candle I'm obsessed with candles at the minute so that's why I do have a candle on there which I need to get a new one to put on there setting sprays a revolution one a candy a cosmetics one and then behind there I do have a lot of my makeup brushes, like I do have a lot of eyeshadow ones, face ones, a lot of beauty blenders as well and I just like I literally have loads of makeup brushes and as you can probably tell they do need a bit of a clean as you can tell. If we move down to this drawer, this is my pride and joy, it's my eyelash drawer, I love my eyelashes so much so I do have some peach and cream, primer, tatty, wispies, I've got pinky goat, primark ones, um, some more Primark ones and yeah, I am just obsessed with eyelashes so I do love eyelashes a lot I do have a chair, like it's an eBay chair actually I do have a cushion in it On the seat it has stained blue a little bit 
but it's a white chair so what do you expect i bought it for 40 pounds on ebay it is literally the best it's literally the most comfiest and just overall amazing chair for sitting and do your makeup in like it's so comfortable so i recommend it and it's super affordable as well so first draw here's my face makeup draw this is very full as you can tell so firstly over here i do have a Too Faced a peachy primer and foundation which I got as an 18th birthday present and as you can tell I hardly have any product left. Then underneath here I do have these amazing foundations which I literally use every day. The base is flawless. It's the Maybelline Superstay Foundations. Use them every day. Like an LA Girl foundation which is actually out of date. I need to check that out. But like it's really orange and it also oxidises. So if you want to buy this foundation please do not because it oxidises really bad and it also stinks of like fake tan it's disgusting and uh, then I do have like another Maybelline foundation I've got a MAC foundation honestly the MAC foundation stink of pain I'm I'm really sorry if you are like a MAC foundation lover but I just can't deal then like a foundation mixer a doll beauty highlighter which I have not used yet but look how pretty that is look how gorgeous that is that is super pretty it's actually gorgeous I've got that and the packaging's really cute as well I also have like other foundations her shade and light palette which contour I've had for years as you can tell I don't really have much left of it her revolution contour palette as well what else do I have I literally have a lot of other foundations I also have a guess of what my favourite concealer could be any guesses yes you were right the revolution concealers i do have a lot of them because i just i love to stock up on them because they i i i, I don't know i'm speechless because they're just so good i do have a few of the nyx ones but those are nowhere near as good as the revolution ones i do have like a glow kind of like primer a number seven airbrush primer this primer is actually so good like it's really good for making your skin look flawless i do have a nyx one um a couple of loose powders from Revolution. I do have my Too Faced bronzer, which is hip pan out. I also got this uh, 18th birthday present, but look how pretty that is inside. I love the packaging of this one. And, like I also have some other primers here. I do have so like a contour palette, favourite powders ever, the Revolution ones, the Urban Decay highlighter palette, a couple of blushes. I do have a dandelion blush as well, which is a benefit one. And oh my god, this this actually smells so good this blusher like it's really nice it's a lovely colour if you are a pale girl like me i recommend you get this one it's so nice i also have a cooler bronzer behind honestly i literally have like a load of makeup under there but like this is the first little open this drawer so i have like over there i do have like a load of blushes um and powders as well but this is my face drawer as you can tell i do own a lot of face products but yeah that's my first drawer here my second drawer it is my eye drawer and this drawer is definitely full to the brim. I could not fit anything else in here. I have my beautiful Violet Voss eyeshadow palette. I literally probably use this all the time. The packaging is gorgeous. Look at that. As you can tell, you'll be able to see that I have a hit pan in some shades. But I love this palette. Like, here's my everyday palette. So I've got that. Then underneath, I literally have a mix of all my mascaras, eyebrow pomades, eyeliners, P. Louise bases, which I love, eyelash glue. So, like, in here, I literally just have loads of Too Faced products, Maybelline, Morphe, Peaches and Cream, Maybelline, NYX, favourite eyelash glue ever is the dual lash glue, I've never tried anything as good as this, but yeah, but that's in there, and a magnet eyeshadow palette, which actually, like I got off my sister actually, all of these are Anastasia eyeshadows, really good actually, they're really soft and blendable. And then I do have a NYX Ultimate Eye Palette, which is so colourful and I love this palette. I also have two Too Faced palettes as well, which are the, are the Christmas ones from two years ago. I never really used them, to be honest, but they're really pretty. And then, all my eye glitters are falling off. I do have a lot of eye pigments because I do love my eye products so much. So, like... A lot of them are peaches and cream because if you guys have never tried peaches and cream, you need to try them. But a lot of them are peaches and cream. I have some Too Faced ones, Tanya Burr, Anastasia, NYX, Stargazer as well. And then under here, I do have some Morphe Edge palettes. Um, fun fact, this Morphe palette here is actually my first ever Morphe palette. 
and like obviously the packaging has changed a lot this is a 3501 as you can tell it, it is quite old looking I've had this for like three years now but it's amazing this palette and it, like it's perfect for everyday eye looks I also have another one which is the Morphe Fat, the Morphe 35H Hotspot palette let's get this one open as well I love the colours in this one I love that colour that colour <laughs> Like, I haven't really used this palette to be honest. I think I should use it more often because I love that, that blue colour in it. It's so pretty. So I've got that one. I do have quite a few Morphe palettes just because I think Morphe ones are really good value for money. So that's why I do have a lot of them. This one is 35M Boss Mood, which is a bit more colourful. I love this one as well. Like, look at all them colours. I love the orange. Honestly, I love orange eyeshadows. I think favourite colour of eyeshadow is orange because it brings out my green eyes. That's a lovely palette. I do have a Beeper Carnival palette, which I'm sure... A lot of girls will have in their collection, I'm not going to lie. Oh boys, look at that beauty. How could you say no to that? This palette is definitely so useful if you want to do any colourful eye looks. It also has some highlights in there, but as you can tell, I have got a bit of orange eyeshadow in that highlight there, so can't use that as highlight anymore. But look at that palette, I, don't, I just don't know how you could say no to that. And then I do have another Morphe palette, which is my biggest one. Don't know if I'll be able to get it out. <laughs> Quite a big one. This is the 35. Oh, I can't. I can't. It won't even fit in the the shop. It's a 35 L. Hit the lights. I, I got this for 19 pounds. Can you believe it? You ready? Look at that. For, it, it was 19 pounds on sale. Look at all the colours. I love like all these ones. I, honestly, it's so colourful. And I do have a lot of other eyeshadow palettes, but um, some of them are kind of trapped underneath. I do have a sample beauty one which is very very pigmented I will I, I just will say it's so good though like it honestly blends so well and I've like I also have a few more ones as well as you guys can probably tell it is my lip drawer and it is a messy drawer because of the like all the lipsticks is hanging about but I do have a few to show you so I do have a few glosses from peaches and cream here which I love so much the quality of these is so good and they're really nice and creamy so I have those ones a lot of lip liners as well some Morphe Primark Maybelline the Revolution ones in there the lip liner sharpener it's always handy to have one of them a lot of Morphe lipsticks because I love Morphe lipsticks so much I have a lovely nude shade also got a red shade and a pinky shade a Anastasia lipstick as well which is like a, a purpley pinky colour very pretty. I do also have MAC lipstick. I've got another Morphe one. The Too Faced ones, which I love the packaging of. The Melted ones. Soap and Glory, Too Faced again. Morphe glosses, which I love. Anastasia glosses. So then over here, I have beauty blenders in the back because that's, that's the only place where I can store them. So I love these ones so much. And you could buy them in Superdrug for like really cheap. At the back here, I do have. Another Morphe eyeshadow palette. This is a 35 XO one. I think it is a Valentine's Day one. Let's get it open. Look at that. Look at that beauty. Look how pretty it is. I love these shades so much. Yeah, but this is my lip drawer. It is a messy drawer, as you guys can tell, but I love it a lot. In my fourth drawer, I do have like a lot of face cloths, mitts, like hairband, tan mitt fake nails over there just in the corner some cotton buds and a load of my nail polishes behind like in a mixing bowl as well draw like it's my beauty draw more than anything really um so yeah but like it is quite organized i would say um so yeah so that's like final draw here's my kind of like my body care draw so let's kind of go through i have my garnier my set of cleansing water I use this for taking off my makeup off and I use the Primark pads as well. I do have a soap and glory one which is good. With my two like spray deodorant from Dove, some charcoal makeup wipes, a Nivea toner, a Nivea cleanser and toner, a T zone, spot zapper, a Mark Jacobs, a body lotion, Daisy Love, which is a lovely scent. I do have Fox tan which like is really good for helping your tan. I do have a Bondi Sands tan, deodorants, 
her body lotions and everything like that in this drawer. So everybody, here is the end of my makeup collection. Honestly, I enjoyed filming this video so much. Like, I absolutely love makeup and this video was so much fun for me to film. So I really hope that you guys have enjoyed. If you have, you know what to do. Make sure to leave a thumbs up, a comment down below and please also subscribe to my channel as well. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye everybody!